Since the start of O'Sullivan's drifting career, he has met Mulvey on three previous occasions. On all three occasions, Mulvey has won. And to add to his superstitions, O'Sullivan has never won in Rose Green. As they begin the run with Mulvey leading, Eric knows that he is just one battle away from burying those hatchets and taking a giant step closer to the 2007 championship. Through turn one, both cars are very close, heading at full speed for the back straight. Eric again positions himself for an attack into turn two. Perfect lines from both drivers means that there is nothing to separate this pair. As they both easily navigate the transition and infield section, the judges are faced with a difficult decision. The result is a 5-5. Everything hangs on this final run. A tactical rolling start to run two does not deceive Mulvey, and the Bridgestone 180SX is stuck to O'Sullivan's bumper through turn one. With nothing to separate the pair down the back straight, the second outer oval curve is again extremely tight, both drivers carrying extraordinary angle and speed. As both scrub off speed for the transition to the infield, Mulvey does appear to sacrifice some angle, however, and O'Sullivan remains perfect. It will be a difficult decision for the Pro Drift judging panel. I started competing, I think my very first event I got Damien in a final or semi-final, he beat me then, I think he's beat me three or four times ever since then, and finally I get him, and here as well where I've never won. Damien, what a day! <laughs> I'm delighted, delighted. Well done, Derek. The car was a small bit underpowered, but it's okay. Hopefully next year we can come back then and do something. Do you reckon Eric has it in the bag? Oh, probably, yeah. Probably. <laughs>